Hey everybody, Matt Ross from QDMA here. We recently got a question from Tim Donges, a longtime volunteer and member in Kansas, wondering what do deer do in the north in the winter when everything is frozen? Where do they get their water? Well, it's a great question, Tim. Deer actually get their water from three major sources. They get it in their food uh, from something called preformed water. They also get it from food through the digestion process called metabolic water. And they obviously also get freestanding water that you can find in puddles, lakes, streams, uh, in catchments, cattle troughs, other places that water might stand. So most people think that they get their water through those that last source. They're going and they're drinking, they're bending down and they're, and they're taking water in. And they do. Um, throughout most of the country, they do have freestanding water through most of the times but they actually get most water from their food. And that includes in the north. So out here, it's frozen. You can see frozen water. You can see snow on the ground behind me. And deer are actually still getting their water requirements by eating things such as the live branches off of trees, buds, the twigs, the ends of those branches, uh, coniferous needles such as white pine. They actually prefer things like hemlock as well as cedar. And they also can eat the bark off of trees. You'll find in deer yards where deer will winter, they'll strip the bark off the trees and they'll dig through the snow to find acorns and other things. So they're actually getting most of their water in their food. Even during the middle of the summer, when it's hot out, most of their water is coming from their food because at that time, most of the foods are actually very full of water. So you don't have to worry about deer throughout most of their range. Uh, in the extreme south, the arid parts of South Texas and other areas, it's certainly an issue. Uh, that's why you might see deer uh, productivity and antler sizes drop when, when think water is absent from their diet. But for the most part, deer are okay in the north, even in the frozen uh, northeast where I live. So if you'd like to ask another question related to deer biology or anything else related to deer, find Ask QDMA on the QDMA website and send us a question. We'd be happy to answer it for you. Thanks and have a great winter.